If you're thinking of moving to Charlotte, you're gonna wanna know a few things. Let's jump in. Hi, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Kristen Rapoli and I'm a realtor with Keller Williams Select. I post new videos every week about living in the Charlotte area. So if that's something you wanna know about, be sure to subscribe and hit the bell so you get notified when I post new videos. If you don't yet live in Charlotte, there are a few things you might wanna know. Number one, Charlotte is a transplant city. Everywhere you look, you're gonna find people who moved here from somewhere. And that means there are less people here who are native Charlotteans. In fact, Charlotte sees about 100 people moving here per day. With fewer natives, that means you might have to dig a little deeper to find the DNA of Charlotte and the culture here. It's here, but you might have to search for it. But it also means greater diversity. We have a huge range of people from all over the world, and you're gonna find your tribe in Charlotte. With 100 people moving here per day, that brings me to number two. Charlotte is growing fast, and that could mean increased traffic. Of course, it's all relative, depending on where you come from. You might find that the traffic here is a walk in the park. But if you come from a place where um, the road systems are really wide and you have like eight lane highways, you might find that you're sitting in traffic a little longer in Charlotte, especially during rush hour. Now the roads are expanding. There's construction everywhere getting these roads to accommodate the population. It just doesn't seem to be happening fast enough. The third thing I wanna mention about Charlotte is the range that you'll find in schools. So we have a huge range. If you look at greatschools.org, you can find reviews and ratings for all of the schools in the whole area. And I really recommend you doing your research before moving here. Because if you find a home in a specific location, you might find that the elementary school is rated a two, but the middle school is rated a seven, and then the high school is rated a four. So you do wanna make sure that it fits your lifestyle. And if schools are important to you, make sure you spend some time looking at this. You'll find a lot of options for schools here and we have a ton of private schools. So if that's something that's important to you, you will find your, the school you want here in Charlotte. The fourth thing I wanna mention about moving to Charlotte is affordable housing. The average home price in Charlotte is $310,000 and the average rent is $1,300 a month. Now, depending on where you're moving from, that might seem high or it might seem low. Big picture, we are just under the national average of $320,000 for home prices. So it's all relative. Just be sure that you're aware of the home prices before you move here and make sure that it fits in your budget. Here's my tip. Decide what's important to you and your family and really do your research. Choose your realtor carefully because your agent already lives here and can help you answer your questions as long as you're asking them and being transparent about what's important to you. So now you know a few things about moving to Charlotte. Be sure to click on the link in the description below for my relocation guide. Thanks so much for watching. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and leave a comment below. See you next week.